G'day guys, welcome to another My Club for this week. My name's Stephen Gillam and today I'm going to take you through a tour of the Waverley Park Museum. Come with me. So we start off uh, with the part of the museum that is attributed back to Glenferry Oval. Uh, there's a lot of uh, old jumpers, boots, lockers uh, that were used up until about five or six years ago when we moved out to Waverley. Uh, a lot of honour boards, uh, the players only door that was uh, through to the change rooms and obviously a lot of our history uh, started at Glenferry Oval and now we're looking to build our own out here at Waverley. Next on our list is the 61 cabinet and uh, it's 50 years ago this year that uh, the 61 side was able to salute uh, with the premiership, first premiership for the club which is being celebrated this year by a DVD uh, released and uh, it's going to have interviews with all the living players. Uh, we've got John Winnicky, uh, that's his grand final jumper there. Jack Cunningham, Guernsey 14, Ian Mort, and Guernsey number 7, Ian Law. Um, and I'm glad you can see the boots there that I'm not wearing them. Uh, 61 Premiership side pretty much paved the way uh, that the respect and uh, regard that Hawthorne's held in now. So there's a special cabinet here in the museum that's just attributed to some famous Guernseys and I've picked out one here that belongs to David Parkin who wears my number, number 27. Uh, obviously David was a premiership captain, a really respected figure at our footy club and I'm proud to keep carrying that tradition on. Other Guernseys are number 15 which obviously Hodgie wears now but Calvin Moore wore it with distinction. Uh, as well, um, you know, triple premiership player, uh, played at centre half back for the club, and uh, number 44, which obviously uh, John Platten wore, the rat, uh, who was a Brownlow medalist, obviously, uh, multiple premiership player for the club. A couple of the uh, current day players have actually joined us in the museum, let's have a chat. Okay, Hodgie, um, what's your favourite bit of the museum, mate? Oh, obviously, uh, tight-lipped, uh, you shrunk a bit too, Hodgie. Um, all right, mate, we'll uh, move on to you, mate. Buddy, um, what's your favourite bit of the museum, mate? Sorry, mate, just didn't quite hear that. Uh, go again. Uh, very, uh, very tight-lipped, the boys. Um, so, from a couple of future Hall of Famers for the club to a Hall of Famer, Peter Knights, who wore the num number 24, which uh, Ben Stratton currently wears, uh, and took Specky after Specky with the blonde mop. Uh, he actually still works at the club as the coterie manager, so uh, Nighty can come and check on his jumper anytime. So I've just got one more piece of memorabilia to show you guys. Follow me. Probably the most recent piece of memorabilia in the museum at the moment is the uh, 2008 Premiership Cup which I was involved in uh, when we walked back on out onto the MCG after uh, everyone had left. We went back out just to soak it all in and I'm actually right up the back towards the left uh, behind Changer's Dreddies, which he's got rid of now. And if you can see Grant Birchall next to me, he's actually not opening his mouth because he's got no front teeth. They were knocked out during the game in the first quarter. So uh, that's it from me guys today. Uh, feel free anytime uh, to come down and visit the museum for yourself. It's level one at Waverley Park and I'll see you next time.